안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami. Today we are in Nami Snatch Salon, but we are not doing our hair. We are doing our makeup. So I uploaded a Halsey BTS Boy With Love Rose Gold hair coloring video, I think last month. In the video, I wore an inspired eyeshadow look for Halsey's makeup in the music video. So I decided to recreate that look again. Let me just zoom you in, get nice and close and personal. So let's start off by priming our eyes. I'm gonna use my Essence Primer. This primer is literally like $3 and it is really good. Just gonna pat this all the way up to my eyebrow. And then I'm gonna take my bronzer. This is the shade that I used to contour my nose and my face. And just contour my eye socket right where if you push, that's where the hollow of your eye in your skull would be. So we're accentuating the bone here and just contouring our eye shape. So moving on to our eyeshadow, I'm just gonna use this bright hot pink from Makeup Forever. I'm literally gonna take my ring finger, place this color on the base ball in the center of my eyelid, and just blend it out. The only thing with applying makeup is that you are watching your technique. So a lot of people think, okay, put this eyeshadow on and then they just throw on the eyeshadow. But you wanna watch where you place it. Where you place it is where you want it to be the brightest and the most pigmented. And then you're going to blend it out and pull it in the direction, in the area that you want it to fade into. And how you place your color on your applicator will affect how the product goes onto your canvas. So there I just tapped it and I'm just gonna tap any remaining color onto the upper ball of my lid to further blend this shade. Now when I find that there's a harsh line anywhere, I'll just go and uh, use a clean finger and just brush out any unblended areas. Now before we put any glitter on, I'm actually going to apply this black eyeshadow with a small pencil brush into my outer corner here, my outer lash line, blending it gently into that pink, almost creating a wing here to define my eye and bring back shape into my eye. I'm gonna run whatever's remaining under my eye as well, just to add a little bit more definition. And to prepare for lashes, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of the black on my inner corner here. You wouldn't have to do this unless I think you were heavily monolighted. I just like to do this to add more definition to my eye and it helps my eye not end up looking too wide set when my lashes are on. It gives it kind of like an all over anchor for the shape of my eye. Let's throw on our glitter now. This one is from Revlon. It's the Photo Ready Eye Art Cream Eyeshadow and Glitter Duo. The duo that I have is in Peach Prism, but I'm just gonna use the glitter portion. I'm gonna take a really thin layer onto a Q-tip and apply this to the ball of my eye, the center of my eye, blending it out. Now it does seem that the makeup artist for Halsey's makeup did use a pink glitter. I am too lazy to dig through my makeup kit, my professional makeup kit to find my pink glitter. So I'm just using what I have on hand and I'm just going in and filling any areas that I see are empty or blotchy. Now the key here is to add a little bit at a time working in thin layers so that your glitter doesn't clump. And I'm actually gonna add two more types of glitter just to add more dimension and depth to the makeup. This first one is from Makeup Forever. I think it's one of their like eye polishes and I'm using the same technique here. The third glittery product here is actually a shimmer. It's the Tear Eye Liner from Etude House. And I'm actually gonna use this to highlight my eye underneath my inner third lower lash line and a little bit on my inner corner. Blending it up into the rest of the shadow. Now the fun part is the eyeliner. 
I'm just taking my black liquid liner and going and lining my eye as I usually would. And normally I do extend it a little bit more outward than upward. I do notice that Halsey has a upward winged liner in the music video with stars extending the liner and continuing in the projection of the line. But I thought it'd actually be cuter to put the stars right up here in the top outer corner of the eye makeup to encapsulate the eye in stars. To do this, I'm actually going to dispense my eyeliner onto my hand and use the tip coated in eyeliner to draw my stars. I'm going with first like the bottom of a stick figure and then the two lines. So I made kind of like an asterisk to make sure my points are a little bit more fine and all of the lines are equal length. And then I'll go in and connect or the points of these lines in a star formation. There we go. Oh, cute. On the inner upper side of this star, I'm actually gonna draw one of those emoji stars. I don't know how to explain it. It's like a four point star. So to do that, I'm just drawing across and adding a different type of star will also add dimension to the look. What I'm doing there is just rounding the corners and it helps sometimes to stretch your skin out to get a crisper line. Oh, it's so cute. Is it not cute? Like, hello. So instead of going eyeliner up, star, star, what I'm doing instead is I'm just putting the stars here to complement my eye shape more. And I feel like this is, I feel like the other look was very editorial and very artistic and it's good for a music video. This look, I feel like I could actually wear it out and it still complements my eye shape. I am also gonna run a little bit of eyeliner on the inner corner here, just underneath where I put that black eyeshadow earlier so that my lashes have something to connect to here on the inside. Curl the lashes and just a tiny bit of mascara to hold up the curl so that the lashes can blend into the false lashes. I'm going to apply my lashes. And the tip that I have for applying lashes is to look down into your mirror and actually come from above your eye. Because often when you come from in front of your eye, you're actually blocking your own vision. Coming from above and looking down into your mirror will actually help you to see what you're doing. Because <laughs> how are you supposed to put lashes on if you can't see? Now we're going to go into our lips. I'm actually gonna use two shades to achieve the kind of soft, rosy nude that Halsey has in the music video. The first one is called Blush Basin from Burt's Bees. And honestly, I could probably get away with just using this one shade. Oh, it's so pretty. I do wanna add some definition to the lip area. So I'm using Private Party from Estee Lauder and just applying this to my inner lip rims. It's the subtle details like these that really give an overall finish to the look. Kind of like how we added more glitter just to add additional definition. And that is the finished look. I really like it. <laughs> It's so pretty. How can you say no to glitter? Like, honestly, I feel like the camera doesn't do it justice. Like, I feel like it's so much prettier in real life. But I hope you liked this video. I am trying to do more makeup tutorials now that I'm getting heavier in my pregnancy and after I give birth, I won't be able to stand and do much hair content. So definitely make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification if you would like to see more videos like this. And if you did like the video, definitely make sure to give it a thumbs up so that we could see if you liked it. If you didn't like it, feel free to give it a thumbs down and definitely help us out by letting us know what you think. I post every day on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat. So I'll check you out on these platforms if these are platforms that you use. That's it, I'll see you next time, bye. Sure.